I have three topics to share about Tesla Giga Berlin, reporting the latest from Giga Berlin, what's happening there. The first is Tesla announces Giga Berlin tours details with a special website for registration. This happened yesterday. Second is cars in Grünheide Giga Berlin plant should come from a single source, reports uh, Brandenburg's public radio. But let's, uh, and the third is interesting new photos that came out today from Tesla Giga Berlin, shared by Tobias Lin. Let's start from Tobias Lin's photos, friends. You're seeing interesting photos. You're seeing the first final road at Giga Berlin. I've covered about this road, but now you can see that there is asphalt on it. And then the, in the second photo, you're seeing the first concrete loading area. Um, it's a loading area where Giga Berlin's uh, stuff will come, uh, parts will come, and they will load and unload probably here. And then it, it's concrete, of course, because there will be heavy materials loaded there. The third, you are seeing the ray bar at the area of refrigerators. I don't know what they will use these refrigerators for, but you know, such a huge company producing electric cars, batteries, I'm sure they will have uh, some things to refrigerate. So this is the ray bar at the area of refrigerators. At least they will have a lot of food cooked in this area for so many thousands of people working at Giga Berlin. And you're saying the battery cell production building, you can see that the uh, stones are going up. It's looking really nice. I will have the reference of Tobias Lin's video in this description of this video, friends. So let me tell you a little bit about uh, what, what's going on in Giga Berlin on October 9. Yesterday, we got news that Tesla Giga Berlin uh, is doing a grand opening. You know, of course, I had reported this earlier tour at Giga Berlin, and this is going to happen on October 9, 2021. This is a monumental occasion and signals that Giga Berlin will be ready to produce electric vehicles shortly after that, maybe right Right after that, the Model Y electric crossover, and that there is a special website for registration uh, details. Tesla released that yesterday, actually. Uh, uh, Jürgen from Giga, uh, who tweets at GF for Tesla, uh, tweeted that uh, a website is called Giga. Uh, dash fest.com uh, I will have the description uh, of that link actually I will have the reference of that link in the description of this video so uh, we had news yesterday of Giga Berlin announcing a factory tour on October 9 2021 this is great news and this likely means that soon after that Giga Berlin will start producing vehicles uh, the official announcement that came was this Tesla opens the doors of its Giga Berlin Giga factory in Grünheide on October 9 2021 21 and invite citizens of Berlin and Brandenburg to a country fair. Uh, join us to experience the most advanced electric vehicle production plant in the world. You'll have the opportunity to see behind the scenes during a factory tour, visit on-site booths, join various activities and ride along in Model Y, our newest electric car to arrive in Europe. Local food trucks will provide catering during the event. This was the end of the uh, quote from uh, Tesla. Now, the country fair at Giga Berlin is open to residents of Brandenburg and Berlin only. It will start at 10 a.m. and end at 7 p.m. on October 9, 2021. So stay with us, subscribe to our channel. We will have lots of photos and videos reporting from there, uh, thanks to our friends who will provide them. Now, only those who are age 16 and older can come without a parent or guardian. A 3G card can be presented to enter the event if you are not vaccinated, says the announcement. More questions are answered at the GigaFest website. Now, beyond this, we expect that we will see how Tesla has organized Giga Berlin with equipment and processes, uh, thinks Jeremy Johnson from Torque News, Tesla reporting him. This is why I'm asking you guys, stick with us and uh, subscribe to our channel and ring the bell so you don't miss my coverage, because on that day, we will have lots of coverage on this Torque News channel. Jeremy Johnson from Torque News Tesla team says, I am most looking, looking forward to pictures of the Giga Press and their paint shop. Uh, I'm also looking forward to details about the Model Y being produced at Giga Berlin. What kind of batteries will it use? What range will the standard and long range versions get? Is there anything new in the interior? I expect to see videos and pictures of test drives of the Germany Model Y. It looks like tickets are going to be very limited 
private so i expect that we'll have to wait for someone to attend the event and take pictures and report on uh, what they see i'll be watching very closely for this says jeremy johnson now guys what do you think of the grand opening of giga berlin are we going to see anything different from the model y in germany i'd like to hear your comments in the comment section below now in brandenburg tesla wants to cast large parts of the car body body in one piece for the first time for this purpose giga press from italy are to be delivered to grunheide other manufacturers could follow suit soon uh, reports rbb24 which is around brandenburg's public radio tesla is known to do a lot of things differently the company also wants to break new ground in production instead of assembling the body of car from many individual parts as is common with other manufacturers large parts at tesla are to be cast from one piece of in the future with the help of huge aluminum casting robots that are about the size of a small house two so-called giga presses enable a completely new type of production said katya legner from the adak automobile association two or at the end only one components are created so there will be two or at the end only one component created by giga press um, now in brandenburg tesla apparently wants to go even further rbb reports that the printing machines were developed by the italian manufacturer idra two of which have been in the tesla factory in fremont in the united states and three in china since the beginning of the year uh, there they produce the rare frame part of the model y electric crossover in one piece which in the previous model 3 still consists of 70 individual parts in grunheide however tesla wants to go even further according to company plans eight of the machines weighing several tons are to be used there and in addition to the rear also manufactured the front underbody from a single cast this was confirmed to the rbb from tesla circus the automobile magazine in tesla mag reported on it first this is a great innovation that cuts the production costs of these parts by 40 percent said stefan bratzel from the center for automotive management automotive research institute in bergisch gladbach in the north rhine westphalia this technology will later also be used in other tesla factories but initially it will be used in brandenburg he says the advantage of the gigapress instead of many small welding robots only a few large machines are required the vehicles can be produced faster which saves costs and that ultimately has an effect on the vehicle price continues bratzel now other manufacturer also could follow suit soon the automotive expert is convinced that other manufacturers will soon follow suit with the large die casting machines the automotive industry always endeavors to reduce the complexity of production and to keep the number of individual parts as low as possible because many parts increase the production effort and ultimately also the cost well friends let me know your thoughts on all of this what do you think who do you think will be the next car co company using giga presses like tesla following tesla suites in the meantime this is armin harian from torquenews.com please subscribe to our channel for daily tesla electric vehicle news so you don't miss my pictures our pictures that we will share from uh, the uh, tour in giga berlin on october 9th and i'll see you soon in our next report look forward for more reports today about tesla and electric cars especially batteries and god Bless you everyone. Be kind to each other. See you soon.